scoring champion Kevin Durant is showing you he has got as complete a game as there is in the NBA. What a pretty pass. Now here's Westbrook with the drive. Outside for Davis. Let's it go. The shot by James, no good. Good shot, gone bad. Gotta finish there. Pass to Brown. Back to Curry. Here's Irving. Up top, Curry. Outside Irving. The Nets need to get off a shot here. It's stolen by James. And finished off by Westbrook. Uh, just fantastic defense by LeBron. You have to protect the ball or he's going to swipe it from you with his lightning quick hands. Durant draws the double. It's Brown on the wing. Takes it inside. Yeah, you never want to let shots at the rim go uncontested. First team foul. And he makes a first. Shooting the rookie. Bruce Brown. And both free throws good for Brown. The Lakers in the lead. To the paint. Here's Davis. The shot's good on the assist by James. Just incredible. I mean, what muscle and balance. These tough finishes help Davis get into a rhythm. And the longevity of LeBron's greatness is unprecedented. The oldest starter in the league last season and still producing at an MVP level. Now here's Irving. From behind the arc. Howard grabs the miss. On the wing, Davis. Pass to Howard. Let's it fly. And there's another one for the Lakers. And what's incredible for LeBron is not just how good he is at his age, but the mileage on his body grade. So true, B.A. I mean, just three players in NBA history have exceeded 60,000 minutes played, including the playoffs. That's Kareem, Carl Malone, and the one and only LeBron James. Here's Drummond. And he banks in the layup. Drummond's got his second bucket of the game. When you think of Seth Curry, you're thinking shooting. But there, what a pretty pass to find the open man. Pass to Durant. It's stolen by James. And it's the Lakers on the break. And jams it home. Westbrook. The absolute ferocity from Russell Westbrook. The rim. My goodness, how you feeling? Outside Irving. Soft touch off the glass. Well, this is one of the best in the league at converting off contact. What body control by Kyrie Irving. Russell Westbrook. And finished off by Westbrook. Wow. I'll tell you, such an advantage having a playmaker who can get up to the rim and finish. Now that is what every team wants. Oh, you love it. Fearless, aggressive, leaving. No doubt whatsoever. And for some reason, he decided to foul there. Yeah, B.A., that's an odd move. Maybe there's something else behind it. I mean, I'm just not sure what he was thinking right there. I mean, he needs to get his head in the game. Pass to Davis. Over Drummond. Brown with the steal. Well read defensively. That window closed so fast. The deep three from Durant. And the ball goes out of bounds. Last touch by Durant. Coming out to the floor for the Lakers. Carmelo Anthony. Now here's Westbrook. Six points for him. And Davis gets double teamed. Anthony outside. Here's Westbrook. Well-timed pass, and he goes straight to the bucket for the layup. Man, that's now 10 straight points in the paint. I'm not sure what's happened to their defense. Pass to Brown. 
Now here's Drummond. And stolen by Anthony. Ooh, he's locked in. Drains his fifth shot in his many attempts. And now we get a little perspective here on how the hustle game has been for Los Angeles. Their frenetic defense has been impressive. Putting ball handlers on the defensive and turning them over as well. You know the coaches hated that shot, but guess what? Some of them go in. Right side, Davis. Back to Bradley. Throws it up high. Ooh, Durant with a steal. Outside, Brown. Pass to Durant. Kick out to Brown. Six on the shot clock. Back to Durant. Gets the three ball to go. And this is Durant's game, right? As soon as he catches the ball, he's ready. Pre-shot preparation outstanding. And you love how effortless Davis makes this look. Rising up for an alley-oop like it's nothing. Now here's Irving. Outside, Brown. Pass to Curry. Drummond with the ball. Westbrook with the rebound. Boy, that's one he wishes he could have back, especially against soft defense. And now we've got an intentional foul. Team second. Lakers substitution. Up top, Davis. And Davis gets double team. Pass to Howard. The six footer. Brooklyn with the board. Most nights this shot would have been his, but the defender gave him just enough trouble. Here's Claxton. Back to Duran. It's stolen by Howard. And Davis slams it home. Among big men in the NBA, Davis can throw it down like nobody else. A great combination of size and hops. It's blocked. To the inside. Anthony. Pass to Davis. Kicks it out to Westbrook. Marked it down low that time. Got hit with the three-second call. The Lakers time call out, time timeout. Out. Out. And the players take this opportunity to get some Gatorade. Getting some fluids in you is so important during these timeouts. Get fresh. Keep those batteries charged. Yeah, without proper hydration, a player can completely run out of gas down the stretch of a ball game. And that's something that none of these guys can afford to have happen. If you're going to battle all the way to the finish, you have to be hydrated. Duran. And down it goes. Two points. Duran's got five points. Boy, what a pretty move. And that's Kevin Durant's forte, right? This guy can find scoring opportunities anywhere. Here's none. Count it. One for one to start the game. Very little resistance around the rim right now. That's the fifth straight bucket they've given up in the paint. To the wing, right side. Here's Claxton. Well, he hasn't scored yet, but I'm sure that'll change. Claxton. Good execution. They're getting some short-range looks here. 
Now, here is James. Six point game. Pass to none. No one near him. The Lakers with the rebound. Boy, he was wide open. You wonder, did he overthink it? That's a missed opportunity. Now Dragic. Outside Durant. Shot clock at six. Yep, that one goes. He has seven. All right, defensively now, you've got to find a way to slow this guy down because he's putting it to you. And they get it back. Lakers ball. And it's out of bounds. The Lakers able to retain possession here. Here's Gabriel. Davis down low. Goes back up. Tries yet again. Claxton with a rebound. Brooklyn with the ball. Trailing by four. And here's Mills from the arc. Doesn't go. And he's 0 for 1 from the floor. Pass to Bradley. Davis with it. Guarded by Durant. Davis drawing the double team. Shoots over Durant. And he gets it back. Davis. And it's good. Two points. Here's Brooklyn. Fifty-two seconds left to play in the first quarter. Outside Durant. The three is up. The offensive rebound. Dragic outside. And Goran Dragic gets the whistle that time. That's his first foul. I love great defense. Just quick to establish his feet, and he takes the hit. Timeout called. Brooklyn. And, of course, Kevin Durant signing a big extension this summer. Fresh off a gold medal in the U.S., where he was the most dominant player in the world in Tokyo. And now locked in his next four years with the Brooklyn Nets. A great deal for him and a great deal for his squad. The Lakers in the lead. James, outside. Bearing his second of three attempts. Yeah, not a lot to be done if LeBron gets a solid screen in a pick-and-roll set like that one. Sixteen seconds left to play in the first. Pass to Irving. Down to five on the shot clock. Fires it. And they get it back. Listen, still one of the elite defenders in the game and certainly one of the most versatile. And so it's Los Angeles. Up by a healthy eight points at the end of the period. They've been aggressive in transition and find themselves in front. We'll be right back after this word. If you're just joining us, we played through one quarter in this one. Taking a look at the Lakers' performance here, guys. What are your thoughts? Well, it's simple. When you can dominate the boards at both ends, you can control the second chance touches. And that's how they controlled the first quarter. I thought they were the much more physical team. Well, if you offer no resistance defensively, he's going to knock down the three. It's really that simple, guys. Back to Edwards. To the middle. Here's Drummond. No good that time. Good work defensively by James. And it's amazing. Their slim advantage on the board seems a lot larger than it is. A chance here to catch up with Allie from the sideline. Thanks, Brian. Well, you want to talk about a super team. Last season, the Brooklyn Nets became the only team in NBA history to boast six players who've made it all NBA over their career. Guys, the roster has changed just a bit, but make no mistake, this team remains loaded in a way we don't see too often. 
No question, Ali. Good stuff there. Thanks. Here's Gabriel. And he was fouled while in the act of shooting. So he'll take two free throws. The first one falls. For Los Angeles. Wenyan Gabriel. Two shots. Second free throw. No good. Brooklyn with the ball. A 12-point game. Outside Edwards. Back to Mills. Outside Edwards. Puts up a three. He buries it from three. Edwards got himself going with a triple. His first basket of the game. James double teamed. Pass to Gabriel. And stolen by Edwards. Second quarter of play with around two minutes gone so far. Now here's Irving. None defends. And here's Mills for three. Offensive rebound. And Drummond with the jam. This is the exact energy you'd like to see from Drummond. He can be a monster on the offensive glass. And he's going for the oop here. Throw it down on the lob. I just love that alley-oop slam, B.A. Defense disorganized, defense pays. Outside, Brown. And here is Irving. He has six. Clock at six. Shoots over Johnson. He can't get it to go. And the Lakers going the other way now. 13 points was their biggest lead of the game. That's been typical of their performance today. They're sharing the ball and creating good shots. Mills with it. Boy, no scoring yet from him, but that's likely to change. Pass to Drummond. Out to the wing. Deflected! And they forced the shot clock violation. Great heat. Substitutions for your nets. Kevin. Now Los Angeles with it. They lead by 11. Curry. Outside none. Pass to Bradley. James, right side. Here's Gabriel. That went off the back iron and out. And the Nets with possession here. Tried by Curry. And it's blocked. Here's Gabriel. Johnson inside. Pass to Gabriel. James outside. And he lobs it up top. So why does LeBron James have the ball in his hands? Because look at that sixth sense. Wow, what a pass. Here's Curry. Drummond with the ball. Got a hand on it. Let's give some credit to the defense for how they're guarding this guy right now because they're refusing to let him get comfortable. The three, James. And they'll get another chance. Here's Gabriel. He's got five. Second chance shot. Rebound Brooklyn. Well, it hasn't been the most efficient game for this guy, but their team is fortunate to still be out in front. Back to Curry. Outside Edwards. To win the drought. Here's Drummond. And that's his fourth bucket in nine attempts. I'll tell you, I wouldn't want to draw Drummond as my assignment inside. You body him up, hack him, it still has no effect on him. Oh, there's the alley! Stolen by Drummond. Outside Curry. Inside. 
Duran inside. Shoots over Johnson. No good. A bit long that time. And they're plus five on the boards after that rebound. Double team on James. Fires from deep. Bradley misses. Brooklyn with the ball. They trail by 11. Outside, Brown. Pass to Drummond. Over Johnson. And a miss there with a chance to cut the lead to single digits. Here's Bradley. Oh, my. Came close to a four-point play. He'll head to the line for three free throws. How about the remarkable improvement of Avery Bradley over time? Once strictly a dominant defender, this guy can make threes. He can drive the lane. There isn't an aspect of the game where he hasn't grown. And he nails the third. He does a great job of drawing contact and getting himself to the line, something he didn't do in the first period. Boy, they need something to go to regain some confidence. No question. Way too many empty possessions for them. The kick out. Curry. They get it back. Drummond. And Drummond with the jam. And it's so hard to stop the putback when you let him live at the rim like that. Boy, once he gets his hands on it around the rim, it's too late. How about the activity level, the effort level? This team right now feeding off his energy. Now a timeout called by the Lakers. Well, Grant, at this point in his career, I think it's safe to say Andre Drummond will go down as one of the game's premier rebounders. Yeah, you just don't call him a specialist because there's a lot more to Drummond's game than just rebounding. Rim protection, points in the paint. He does just about everything you want in a big man. When he's on the floor, he lightens the load on every other member of their front court. Pass to Durant. It's Brown on the wing. He shoots it. Count it. He's four for eight now. This guy is a pick-your-poison kind of player. Very hard defensively to cover all your bases with him. Westbrook right side. Anthony outside. And there's the lob. He got a piece of it. Howard. Boy, Howard. Laid it in with a nice touch off the window. Howard's got six points. You have to credit their effort. I mean, they've done an amazing job on the glass. Now here's Irving. Pass to Claxton. On the wing, Durant. The three ball. Westbrook with the rebound. And it's a Lakers ball. He takes it in. Here's Davis. That's good. And so Westbrook with the assist. Ten points for him. Well, the aggressiveness of Russell Westbrook setting up that bucket right there. This guy knows how to find the best shot possible. <laughs> Once he breaks out the crossover, you just know something special is about to happen. Now Westbrook. Ten points for him. Pass to Howard. Shoots over Durant. Nice D from Durant. Brooklyn with the ball. A 12-point game. And the Nets, another three. They're making a few more threes this quarter, trying to cut into that deficit. Out to Anthony. Down low. Westbrook outside. Drives to the hoop. And finished off by Westbrook. Now uh, you cannot give Russell Westbrook a lane to the basket. This guy will slam it in your face quicker than you can say boo. Pass to Claxton. Back to Irving. And here's Brown. Irving, no good. <laughs> I'll tell you what, they rebounded the ball tremendously well. Now Monk. 
Outside Davis. Last two minutes to play. Second Pass quarter. to Howard. Brooklyn with the board. Outside Irving. And there's a minute 45 left to play in the half. Here's Durant. And there's another one for the net. Well, listen, you do the best you can to make Kevin Durant take tough shots. But this guy, lightning quick release, unbelievable shooter, so hard to guard him. Here's Davis. And finished off by Davis. Oh, nice one-handed jam there, B.A. Hey, little exclamation point. It's Brown on the wing. Outside for Irving. Back to Brown. From downtown. And good. Coming on the assist by Irving. Brown's got five points. And the defense is really allowing them too much room on the perimeter. Half to the outside. And it's out of bounds. The Lakers able to retain possession here. Off the inbound. Brooklyn trailing. Pass to Durant. Here's Claxton. Outside, Brown. Outside, Irving. Here's Durant. Checked by Davis. There's the triple. Howard grabs the miss. And they're doing strong work on the glass. A plus five advantage for them. Hello, Anthony. That's one of the qualities you just love watching. I mean, Melo rises and fires, drops the J pretty much whenever he sees a little bit of space. Timeout called. The Nets. Protecting the rim has to be their top objective right now. And the question they're going to have to answer to me is, is it a problem with the scheme or is it a problem with matchups? And the Nets with possession here. On the attack, Curry. And it's blocked by Davis. Dominant on the defensive end. AD can change games with his length. Getting a block just right there. Here's James. Oh, got it off in time, but it's no good. And as we dive into the second half, we'll find out if the next two quarters are any different from the first two. So far, it's been a runaway. And here is Irving. Pass to Brown. Back to Irving. Six to shoot. And that basket makes him five for ten. Steady production so far. And even through contact, Kyrie still able to finish shots consistently. Here's James. Oh, he powers right through the defender for the dunk. Draws the foul, too. And he'll go to the line. It goes on Kyrie Irving. That free throw, good from James. Well, how about a multi-time champion and a multi-time MVP? And LeBron James continues to dominate. It truly is special to watch. To the inside. Outside, Brown. And good. Coming on the assist by Irving. Brown's got eight points. Kyrie Irving doing work with the pass. That's pretty. James double team. Oh, and makes it with the kiss. Ten points for him. And trust me, when the D's slow to react, he'll be the first guy to make them pay. 
And that's typical of this guy. He's always reading the situation, reacting quickly and capitalizing. Irving with it. 11 points in the game. Shot is good. Off the back rim and in. Wow, what a start. Three for three. Terrific play calling. Everything clicking out of the gates here. Pass to James. Back to none. Johnson with it. Let's it go from 14. And Kyrie Irving clears the rebound. Drummond with the ball. Outside Durant. Back to Curry. The three. And the Nets, another three. And they're rolling. Four straight makes to start the second half. Outside for Davis. And he can't get that one. And Brooklyn will go the other way with it. Just over two and a half minutes going by in the second half. Drummond, high post. Drummond double teamed. Rejected by James. Oh, you watch the John. Not a prolific shot blocker. But when he wants to get it done, he is emphatic. Dwight Howard. And Brooklyn has possession. They trail by six. Here's Bradley. He's got five. To the paint. Count the bucket. Coming off a perfectly placed pass. Howard's got eight points. They just look so overwhelmed inside. That's why they continue to get attacked. Pass to Curry. Now here's Brown. Give him eight. Ooh, Howard with a block. Now Dwight Howard at his best, sending it back. And again, it's the Nets missing. James with the ball. And Drummond picks him up defensively. Here's Bradley. James, left side. James double team. Hey, here's none for three. And another three for the Lakers. And just totally relentless. Only increasing the intensity level. One thing I enjoy is watching players who don't pay attention to the score. You lock in on the moment and play the right way. Boy, and when it comes to providing leadership, everyone tackles it a little bit differently. Irving isn't that Kevin Garnett type motivator. He's not going to talk all game like Chris Paul. This guy leads with his play. Back to Curry. Brown in the high post. And Seth Curry is going to pick up the foul. That's his first foul. And just a great job of getting there first and absorbing the contact. Here's none. Leading by 12. And what we've seen is guys want to play alongside Irving. Yeah, people who know him best vouch for him. And will even join a team partly because of him. Plus, this guy is so insanely talented. You know when he's on, he gives you the best chance to win. Pass to Brown. Right side, Irving. Five to shoot. Brown with it. And Howard picks him up defensively. Good work there as it goes. From Kyrie. Brown's got five points now this quarter. Well, the evolution of Kyrie Irving continues. He comes in as a scoring point guard, but more and more those passing skills are on display. All right, let's get a report from Allie. All right, B.A., Russell Westbrook last season said titles won't define him. He said, quote, I grew up in the streets. I'm a champion. I don't have to be an NBA champion. My legacy isn't based on what I do on this court. It's what I do off the floor. How many people I'm able to impact and inspire. A different perspective, Allie. Good stuff. Time called here. The Lakers decide to talk it over. And your Brooklyn Yeah, we're just
Red Dead Team. Make some noise, fans. Trying to claw their way back into this. And the best way to do that, minimize your mistakes and take good shots. Driving inside. And it's blocked by Davis. Davis drawing the double team. Tries a 10-footer. And they turn it over. Shot clock violation as the buzzer sounds. And they'd love to cut this deficit down to single digits. Here's Irving. Pass to Claxton. Launches it. The Lakers with a rebound. The biggest lead of the game, 15 points. Well, he hasn't proven to be much of a floor spacer for them. He had the 1-3, but that was back in the first half. Right side, Davis. Out to Anthony. Here's Gabriel. Shoots over Curry. And that one's good. Gabriel. He's got seven. The size mismatch makes that a high percentage look. Pass to Durant. The kick out, Curry. And that comes off the assist by Durant. Curry's got six in the quarter. Curry. Well, like it runs in the family, Seth Curry building a career on his aptitude from distance. And boy, oh boy, did he do some damage. And a moment to look at the scoring approach in terms of where the points are coming from here for the Lakers. They haven't been pushed around in the paint at all in this game. They've been the aggressors. And KD always in the debate over who's the top dog in this league. And what's interesting is he doesn't really want any part of that discussion. He said, one thing I told myself, don't worry about who people say is the best player. Locking out distractions is key to achieving greatness. Durant drives in. The layup misses. And right now, they're plus eight in the rebounding category. That's helping them run away with this. And Irving comes to help. Back to Anthony. Outside Davis. Anthony in the post. Shoots over Durant. Oh, denied by Durant. They still have time to make this a game. But they really need to focus in because they let this game get away from them a little bit. And Russell Westbrook gets the whistle that time. That's foul number two for him. On the wing, Durant. He's got 16. Bills attacking. And blocked. That one goes careening off the glass. Over to the wing. Pass to Gabriel. Stolen by Mills. Durant has the open look. Who oh, drains the 19-footer. Durant's gotten four this quarter. Boy, Kevin Durant, an absolute nightmare in transition. Combined size, speed, great scoring ability. Look out. And this kind of six slam is just one of the reasons this team is in charge of this game right now, B.A. You know, there's an edge the way they play and a confidence they're not afraid to show. Here's Durant. And it's slammed in by Durant. Well, we know he's got takeover ability. And Kevin Durant is cooking right now. After the outside. Right side, Davis. And stolen by Edwards. Pass to Mills. The kick to Durant. Five on the clock. Now Dragic. From deep. 
Monk grabs the miss. Part of why they have this lead, they're doing the little things out there. Three-pointer Anthony. And the Lakers hit again from deep. Just so fluid on all his shots. No hesitation from Melo on the catch and shoot. Here we go, one-on-one. -on -one. Not sure why he committed the intentional foul. No purpose. I think everyone's a little confused, but weird plays happen. We've got a minute 48 left in the third quarter. Anthony, left side. On the wing, Davis. Six on the shot clock. On the take. Again, the Lakers score. And Davis just has the physicality to own the paint. Defenses just can't do much to stop him down low. Pass to Durant. Here's Mills. And the Nets miss again. A wasted trip down the floor. That's not a good shot at all. Well, missed opportunities, and they can certainly add up. You cannot afford to take that kind of shot. Here's Gabriel. He's guarded by Mills. And so they choose to intentionally foul. Gabriel. Time called here. The Lakers decide to talk it over. And they got to refocus. Too many careless turnovers will kill your momentum. Los Angeles. T-shirts, T-shirts, T-shirts. Come on, everybody. We got T-shirts for everybody. There's 53 seconds left to play in the third quarter here. It's stolen by James. And he lobs it up to the rim. Up high and down it goes on the lob. They're really in control on both ends of the floor right now. Forcing turnovers and finding easy points while the other guys struggle to keep up. And they're up considerably because of their efforts on the glass. That free throw, good from James. And man, looking good from the line so far this half. A difficult situation for Brooklyn. We've got a nine-second difference between the shot clock and game clock. Outside Mills. Outside for Irving. Just five to shoot. Back to Mills. To stop the run. Rebounded by Gabriel. In transition! Here's Bradley. Oh, no good on the last second attempt there. And so it's Los Angeles. And with the fourth quarter upon us, time is running out for this game to become competitive. And the Lakers have possession. Nunn drives in. James, outside. Pass to Bradley. Clock at six. Now James. LeBron James. Good. Five for nine shooting so far. After taking some time to find his rhythm, he's been unstoppable since the break. Irving. Claxton attacking. Blocked! And as it goes out of bounds, Brooklyn, Brooklyn able to keep possession. It's stolen by James. Fast break. Here come the Lakers. Pass to Gabriel. To the middle. And it's James with the jam. Yeah, LeBron James will inflict pain at the rim when he gets free like that. 
I'll tell you, man, Irving can do many things for your ball club. But at the top of the list, he's a tremendous shooter with great range and great confidence. You know, if you were to hand select a player to take the last shot for you, no one would bat an eye if you chose Kyrie Irving. Ever since his shot over Steph Curry in 2016, Irving's been a legend. And some of it's his mental approach. People say he marches to the beat of a different drum. That may help him in those big moments. It's James on the wing. Pass to Bradley. Just five on the clock. Back to none. The three. The shot, no good. And Brooklyn going the other way now. Los Angeles foul. Avery Jackson. His first foul. Team second. Fourth quarter now. We're about a minute and a half in. Andre Drummond. Bruce Brown. Driving to the basket. And the layup falls. Good job attacking. Those restricted area shots are what every NBA team is looking for. None. No good. And a big issue for them, turnovers. Yeah, you just can't give away possessions in this league. On the attack, Curry. Here's Drummond. And the jam by Drummond. Well, he's such a good athlete for a center. It's how he's able to succeed despite being one of the smallest fives in the NBA. They double him with Brown. Back to none. Kevin Durant with a rebound. And here are the Nets now. It's a 16-point game. Kick out to Brown. Second shot opportunity. Pass to Irving. Shot clock at six. Back to Brown. No good from outside. Just about three minutes through the fourth and final quarter here. And Irving comes to help. Back to Bradley. And here's James. Now none. Defended by Brown. So Bruce Brown is going to pick up the foul. That's his third personal. That's his third foul of the game. And the Lakers making a change here. Dwight Howard. Anthony Davis. Six to shoot. And he's going for the lob. Stolen away. Nice job to interrupt the alley-oop attempt. Outside, Brown. It's Brown on the wing. Durant for three. Rebound, the Lakers. Yeah, and the defense has really got to tighten up on him. I mean, he's just too dangerous from the three-point line. Curry with a steal. Pass to Brown. Here's Drummond. Kick out to Brown. Shot clock at five. Howard with some nice D. Great rim protection to prevent him from converting. Beautiful. Here's Bradley. Davis drawing the double team. Tries to snap the cold streak. And a foul called on the way up. So he'll take two from the free throw line. It goes on Kevin Durant. And the more Davis has added muscle during his career, it really has helped him on the offensive end. It forces defenses to foul him. First free throw is good. Well, Anthony Davis helped rescuing the Lakers from some lean years. In the six seasons prior to his arrival, they'd missed the playoffs more times than in the previous 65 years of the franchise. And a year after they got him, they're hoisting the Larry O'Brien Trophy. And now with his new contract, he should help them compete for a long time to come. And there's the slam dunk to finish it off. Making the most of the second chance opportunity. Hey, the hustle is real and the hustle is rewarded. 
Nice catch and finish on the lob. And the Lakers lead by 18. Smooth finish off a terrific feed. Man, the timing and execution couldn't have been any better right there. Durant. And Durant with the big finish. Well, the size and height of Kevin Durant makes him a prime threat to throw it down. You've got to keep him out of the paint. Everyone loves the alley you play, B.A. Yep, one of the prettiest in basketball. Here's Durant. You can see right there the three-time defensive player of the year is still an intimidating presence on that end. Pass to Bradley. Out of bounds, it'll be the Nets ball. Nets ball. And here is Irving. Here's Claxton. Irving with it. And here's Curry for three. That's a three. Pure from three-point range. Curry. Boy, had this shot on automatic. The confidence so crucial to what Seth Curry brings to the table. And no surprise here, right? This guy is not only a gifted player, but he is so smart on the offensive end. And they doubled up Irving. Claxton down low. Los Angeles foul. And there's just one foul now away from the penalty. That's his second personal. Fourth team foul. And stolen by Anthony. They've been making plays like this all night. Just sharp defense, not taking any possessions off. Pass to Durant. For three. And again, Brooklyn with the triple. Well, Kevin Durant is a dead-eye sniper, right? He takes pleasure in putting it to the defense from there. Anthony misses. Boy, he won't miss many from that spot. The defense gets lucky there. Here's Curry. Oh, and he blocks it off the glass. Wow. Here's the three. Sinks the tray. And the Lakers lead by 17. And they keep attacking from the three-point range here in the second half. Well, KD just lethal on the drive for the rack, and he gets ahead of steam behind him. Forget about it. Pass to James. Three-pointer, Anthony. And the Lakers get it back. Controls the rebound and the putback. This guy is cooking right now. He is leading them on the offensive end as they remain in front here. Here's Durant. And good. Coming on the assist by Irving. Durant's got nine points now in the quarter. Anthony outside. Jacks up a three. Down low. Got a piece of it. Here's Davis. Here's Howard. Another shot. And he takes it up and lays it in. More points coming from inside. In that respect, they've been the more aggressive team. And the shot's good by Irving. Boy, terrific read. Kyrie Irving understands what the defense is giving him and takes advantage. Pass to Bradley. Beyond the arc. Avery On target from range. <laughs> Whoa, that man is laser focused. Now, that's bad defense for a team that has a long way to go to catch up. Well, credit the offense, though. If you're going to come with casual defensive effort, this team's responsibility is to take advantage, and they do. And here's Anthony, defended by Brown. On the wing, Bradley. Back to Anthony. Pass to James. Four on the clock. The Lakers got to get one up. Late clock. The shot by Howard, no good. All by himself, trying to step up. He's got to be frustrated with the miss. And it goes out of bounds. That one off Howard. Outside Irving. Driving in. And there's a whistle. He'll head to the line to shoot two. Boy, just a great use of the pump fake by Irving to draw that defender into fouling him. At the line. And he makes both free throws. 
He's forcing the action now, finally getting to the charity stripe after no freebies in the first half. Pass to Bradley. Davis with it. Claxton with a rebound. Outside Irving. Stolen by Davis. Here's Howard. And it's Howard finishing it off. That's the court vision of Avery Bradley. Remarkable how he finds these wide open teammates on a consistent basis. Here's Irving. Oh, he got him with a pump fake, but he couldn't finish. To the inside. Oh, got a piece of it. Now, here is Howard. Back to Bradley. Clock at six. Fires the three. That shot is off. And it's the Nets taking it the other way. Irving, that's good. Irving's got 12 points in just the second half. You know this, Kyrie Irving, when he has the hot hand, is lethal. On a night-by-night -night basis, he is an absolute matchup nightmare. They came out and had a statement win with their performance tonight. A fantastic effort to get it done here for the Lakers. They had more assist and shot the ball more efficiently. Those things tend to go hand in hand. And that's so true. Without a doubt, their ball movement was essential to winning this game. And as most people predicted, the defense, even though they were king on him, had no answers for LeBron James. He ran things with precision. Great command of the offense, putting his teammates in all the right spots. Here's James. The kick to Durant. The three is up. Rebounded by the Lakers. Outside Curry. Outside Irving. From deep. Buries it from three. You know, I think this guy just loves the game of basketball. The preparation, the interaction with his teammates. He has fun out there on the floor. Now eight seconds separating the two clocks. Duran on the attack. No good on the shot. And out of bounds. Los Angeles will have it. 23 seconds left in the fourth quarter. And he lobs it up! And Davis slams it home! What a performance tonight. Getting a win like this on the road is such a boost. You've got to be able to block out all distractions in enemy territory. This team did a tremendous job staying focused on the task at hand. Oh, Durant with a steal! Right side, Irving. With the putback. Oh, he hangs in there and cashes in on the second chance points. Real smooth, guys. Great job with the tip in. Those are the kind of plays on the offensive glass that can tell you a lot about a player. And so it's the Lakers easily grabbing this one. Boy, a nice win on the road. By the time this one was winding down, this building was stone cold silent. And that's exactly what you got to do. You have to try to take...